Hello dear students, I am Binav Negi. Welcome you all in your own platform that is resultant. Guys, mechanical paper is done. So, what are the some questions that were in the mechanical paper that I am solving? And uh, we have these questions on the memory base, but a lot of questions we have got and same type of questions we got from many number of students that I can assure you that these are the questions that have been in the actual paper as well. Although we'll be getting them once the response key will be out, but as the same question is repeatedly given by many students, so we can almost sure we are almost sure that these were the questions that were in the exam and all the civil engineering students those will be giving the examination in the third weekend they can take the idea that what type or what difficulty level questions were asked uh, guys please subscribe the channel for all such updates for all technical sessions and important updates those who are new in the channel let me introduce myself guys my name is abhinav negi i have done my mtech from iit delhi got all india rank 164 in 2012 in gate you have to score better than this guys okay this is my telegram group civil by abhinav sir uh, more than 6000 students have already joined there and let me tell you guys since som is not the only subject which is common there are other subjects like som fm mathematics engineering math pert cpm pert cpm aptitude so these all questions will be in this telegram group by tonight okay within next two to three hours all mechanical gate 2025 questions with solutions you will get in my telegram group civil by vinav sir within next two hours okay right now in this session i am solving only som but som fm mathematics aptitude or cpm all the common questions of mechanical paper you will be getting in my telegram group civil by abhinav sir the link of my telegram group is in the description box you will get in within next two hours okay once more guys one more thing that every day we have started a initiation in my telegram group civil by abhinav sir every day we are posting a quiz every day and in the evening we are posting the solution every day quiz on my telegram group and on the same day for the same questions we are posting the solution in the evening okay so please do attempt these questions for being exam ready before coming to the question guys let me tell you we have opened the batch for the admission in 2026 the price right now is 18999 you will get live plus recorded classes okay you will get 50 plus weekly test 150 plus test 3500 plus question bank which includes mcq msq nat study notes of each and every subject doubt resolution interview guidance program and pyq of each and every subject along with the formula book for any detail guys you can connect me in this number okay or my email id abhinav@resultant.in or you can connect me on this phone number 9354916360 okay okay guys so this is the first question on your screen what the question was there let me tell you guys a metallic square plate is subjected to uniform hydrostatic pressure uniform hydrostatic pressure okay choose the mohs circle representing the state of the stress at any point in the plate guys it is hydrostatic stress it will be compressive guys okay and they have said that normal stress is positive towards right and shear stress is positive towards upward so guys hydrostatic means when in all direction the stress is same it is mohs circle so it is 2d they are talking of 2d so here is also sigma hydrostatic is compressive here is also sigma that is hydrostatic means all direction it is same okay it is not sigma x sigma y both are same so what is the center center is sigma x plus sigma y by 2 comma 0 center formula is sigma x by sigma y uh, sigma x plus sigma y by 2 comma 0 sigma x is both are compression by 2 comma 0 so center is minus sigma comma 0 center for this is minus sigma comma 0 let me be little side and what is the formula for radius what is the formula for radius it is sigma x minus sigma y by whole to square okay so when you do this it will be 0 square plus 0 square so radius will be 0 so it will be a point so that is option number b can't you solve this 
please tell me on the comment box the same question will be coming in civil engineering can't you solve this everyone please let me know yaar on the comment section if the same question comes in your civil engineering paper if the same question comes in your civil engineering paper can't you solve and kill this question प्रिंस कर लोगे ना एग्जाम में ऐसा आएगा तो ओके लेट अस सी क्वेश्चन नंबर टू लेट मी टेल यू गाइस दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम थ्योरी ऑफ फेलियर्स दिस क्वेश्चन इज थ्योरी ऑफ फेलियर्स नॉट इन द गेट सिलेबस ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियरिंग नॉट इन गेट सिलेबस ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियरिंग बट इन ई एस सिलेबस बट इन ई एस सिलेबस गेट के सिलेबस में नहीं है बट इट इज इन द ई एस सिलेबस and they are asking the yield stress value is given van mises theory that is the shear strain energy theory the sigma y formula is given by the sigma y formula is given by this tau by root 200 by root 3 the yield stress in pure shear condition it is 200 by root 3 please tell me the value guys how much you are getting it are you getting 115.5 are you getting 115.5 let me tell you guys for gate gate examinations civil engineering uh, they can skip theory of failures because this is not in your uh, this is not in your gate syllabus last update was in 2021 so in 2021 they have deleted it from the gate syllabus but still it is there in the other exams and engineering services now this is the question udm i have not told in the class tell me here udm every year this is the question of the class those students who are my classroom students please tell me haven't we solved this udm uniformly distributed movement haven't we solved this uniformly distributed movement we have solved even a tougher question this is very easy a simply supported beam of length 1 meter is subjected to udm uniformly distributed movement uniformly distributed movement of 1 newton per meter a 1 newton meter per meter throughout the length what is the bending moment at midpoint of the beam let this reaction be ra let this reaction be rb so summation fy is equal to 0 so ra plus rb is equal to 0 one equation guys to be in equilibrium movement about any 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 point should be zero so summation of movement about b should be zero summation of movement about b should be zero so clockwise movement i am taking positive so ra into length length is 1 meter and this is 1 newton meter per meter so in 1 meter the total movement will be 1 and this is also clockwise this is also clockwise so per meter it is this much and total length is 1 meter only so this is zero so ra value from here will be minus 1 so ra value will be minus 1 so rb value will be plus 1 because ra plus rb is equal to zero so minus means our direction is wrong so actual direction is this one one this is the actual direction and here the value is positive so this is actual, this is direction is correct and guys i already told you in the class you have one more way to find out that what will be the direction of ra and rb see guys this is a clockwise movement the acting movement here udm is clockwise so it trends it tries to make the beam clockwise okay but mazak to ho nahi raha mazak to ho nahi raha so this simply supported this a point will not be allowing it to go upward na so where the reaction will be downward okay without any calculation we can know that it is downward why i am again telling please listen this is a clockwise movement so clockwise this beam will rotate clockwise so this beam will go upward so this a support will pull it downward so downward reaction so from here this clockwise movement is making this beam going downward but ye b mein mazak to ho nahi raha so this b point will tend it to keep there only so it will provide upward reaction got it now we have to find out bending moment at midpoint let midpoint be this c point so bending movement at c point c from left or right let us see from left so this one downward load so downward load i am taking negative so minus 1 into 0.5 okay plus this is clockwise movement okay so plus section left clockwise plus so this is 1 per meter but left hand side it is only 0.5 meter length left hand side it is only 0.5 so 1 into 0.5 so this is the summation what is the bending moment summation of moments from the left hand side so for this one it is 1 into 0.5 for this left hand side what is the total moment per meter it is 1 but it is only 0.5 meter so 1 into 0.5 so what is the value what is the value it is 0 
सो आंसर विल बी जीरो दिस वॉज अन एटी क्वेश्चन दिस वॉज अन एटी क्वेश्चन अरुण श्याम बाबू एवरी वन वेलकम गाइज इफ द सेम क्वेश्चन कम्स इन योर सिविल इंजीनियरिंग पेपर कांट यू सॉल्व दिस वी हैव सॉल्व इवन अ टफर क्वेश्चन इवन मच 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 मोर टफर क्वेश्चन इन अवर एस एफ डी बी एम डी चैप्टर इन क्लास रूम ऑफ रिजल्टेंट प्लीज टेल मी ऑल माई क्लास रूम स्टूडेंट्स If the same question comes in your examination, this will be a boost up for you guys. Oh wow, Arun! Excellent. Our old student Arun, NHPC me list wai naam. Excellent. Short list in NHPC. Congratulations, Arun! You have made all us proud. You have made all us proud. Okay, solve this na. Siam Babu and everyone. Yes, Sachin is saying he can do this. Okay, guys. There are more questions. Let me tell you, guys, that we have the complete, complete course for Gate 2026 and 27. Where you will be getting live plus record classes, study notes, question bank, PYQs, question bank of every subject, test series, complete test series like Gate platform, Gate interface, PYQ of every subject, study notes of every subject. You will be getting plus formula notes of every subject. You will be getting. Okay, you can download the app from the Play Store. Now, this is one more question that has been asked in Gate 2025. a uh, isotropic brittle material is tested in a universal testing machine the stress strain diagram is given uh, what is the strain energy density guys can you tell me what is the area under p delta curve i have proved this in the class what is the area under p delta curve the area under p delta curve is strain energy i have given the complete proof in the class and what is the area under stress strain curve stress strain what is the area under stress strain curve this is strain energy per unit volume i also told guys this is p by a and this is delta by l so in denominator it is area into length na as compared to p and delta here denominator area into length area into length is volume so here denominator volume is also coming so strain energy per unit volume is strain energy density strain energy density is nothing But it is strain energy per unit volume, which is equal to area under stress strain curve. So you can calculate this area. Please tell me, guys, this area plus this area, green plus white area. So what is the green area? Half base is point zero one into height is hundred. Plus, what is that white area? Area of that trapezium. So it is one twenty and hundred. So total length is point zero one five, point zero one five minus point zero one. It is the total length and into area of trapezium. I am just applying one twenty and hundred average. It is hundred ten. So what is the value, guys? What is the value you are getting from here? Tell me, please. Tell me, please. What is the value? Are you getting one point zero four mega joule per meter cube? One point zero four mega joule per meter cube. So here it will be one point zero five. Please tell me. Here it will be one point zero five. Okay. Now next question. Guys, I always tell na that more circle question every time. If you have seen my sessions, if you have taken my classes, either on the app or on the YouTube, one statement I have given you many times, and that statement was, that statement was that from last four years in every set, morning set and evening set, transformation of stress question or more circle question is coming. I told you this. Have you remembered this in my class or in YouTube sessions? That from last four years. in set in morning session in uh, evening session that is forenoon and afternoon in both sessions transformation of stress question is coming so it has come here also na this one this one okay now this is the question this is the x direction this is the y direction this is the z this is x this is y and that is z so what is the strain in z it is sigma z by e Minus sigma x by e minus mu sigma y by e. So in z direction there is no stress zero. Okay, minus mu. 
सो माइनस म्यू म्यू इज पॉइंट टू सेवन ओके सिग्मा एक्स इज थ्री फिफ्टी दिस इज पॉइंट टू सेवन दिस इज पॉइंट टू सेवन इन टू थ्री फिफ्टी बाई इज टू हंड्रेड बोथ अरिंगी का पेस्कल माइनस म्यू पॉइंट टू सेवन सिग्मा वाइज वन फिफ्टी इज कंप्रेशन सो इज माइनस वन फिफ्टी बाई ई टू हंड्रेड सो दिस वैल्यू इज टू हंड्रेड पॉइंट टू सेवन इंटू वन फिफ्टी एंड दिस इज थ्री फिफ्टी सो इफ यू टेक कॉमन पॉइंट टू सेवन इट विल बी टू हंड्रेड सो इट विल बी पॉइंट टू सेवन स्ट्रेन इज यूनिटलेस स्ट्रेन इज यूनिटलेस स्ट्रेन इज यूनिटलेस ओके एंड इट विल बी इन माइनस ओके सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन गाइज so these are the questions that has been asked you can follow us on the instagram and pay uh, you can follow us on instagram and facebook let me again tell you guys that in my telegram group civil by abhinav sir we are more than 6000 students are there we will be posting the solution of complete som fm engineering mathematics per cpm aptitude because these are the only common subjects with mechanical na these are the only common subjects with mechanical production ka dal ke civil wale kya karenge थर्मोडाइनिक्स का इफ आई पुट थर्मोडाइनिक्स व्हाट सिविल स्टूडेंट्स विल डू सो ऑल द मैकेनिकल क्वेश्चंस व्हिच आर रिलेटेड और व्हिच आर कॉमन सब्जेक्ट ऑफ सिविल विल बी पोस्टिंग इन आवर टेलीग्राम ग्रुप विद इन नेक्स्ट टू टू थ्री आवर्स ओके एंड एवरी डे इन माई टेलीग्राम ग्रुप सिविल बाय अभिन सर वी आर पोस्टिंग द क्विज मॉर्निंग वी आर पुटिंग द क्विज एंड इवनिंग वी आर पुटिंग द सोल्यूशन फॉर द सेम क्विज प्लीज टेक द एडवांटेज सिविल बाय अभिन सर ओके एंड फॉर द टू एंड ट्वेंटी स्टूडेंट्स 2026 and 2027 students we have the complete complete course where you will be getting live plus recorded classes for every subject you will be getting question bank for every subject you will getting study notes for every subject you are getting formula book for every subject you are getting the workbook for every subject you will be getting the complete test series on this formula book for every subject study notes for every subject pyq and workbook you can download for lifetime okay thank you thank you everyone i hope you enjoyed the session please let me know your views on these questions on the comment box if the same questions will be coming in civil engineering or same level of questions will be coming in civil engineering can't you solve all of them thank you thank you all